Right, hello, this is Shaman here, and uh, welcome back to Forgive Me Father 2. I'm hoping uh, to make this a lost episode, so it might be longer than the others, might be shorter, might be the same length, we'll see. I'm going to read the uh, letter and then we'll keep moving, I guess. Uh, dear friend, I've heard a story from an explorer who came to our town talking about a base somewhere deep in the north mentioned an expedition that was sent to explore these areas when they descended into the underground caves. They found structures that could not have been made by humans. The explorers claimed these constructions were created by forces beyond our world. The traces of that civilization resembled nothing known, alien, unsettling uh, forms, as if the cosmos had left its mark there. Stories circulated of apparitions and beasts glimpsed at the edge of vision, stirring fears deeply rooted in the subconscious. The strangest thing is that he refused to provide the exact location. He claimed that where they ventured, no one else should set foot again. Stay away from the, from the stories about those frozen wastelands. Sometimes it's better to leave secrets in an icy tomb where the human mind cannot reach. Whatever was weakened in your mind is now gone. Are you gonna to prove that your faith is strong enough? Face your doubts and end the suffering. I still can't tell whether that voice is antagonistic or helpful. Seems to be somewhere in between. Man, I have no ammo. Huh. Oh yeah, the sniper came back. Uh, the last few levels as well. Ow. I noticed it, but I forgot to say anything. <laughs> Alright, how are these clocks still here? Yeah. Why wouldn't they be here? Or in the gardens, too. Which way am I supposed to go? It's just one big circle. No. No idea what that's what's in that other direction. Maybe it's just an alternate path to here. sounding uh, music over the frozen wasteland. Oh, 
always see them against this white backdrop. Yeah. Hopefully we manage. Wait, where's the last one? Here? Come on. I hope this is the right way. Would have seen <laughs> these guys playing in the most of these guys playing pretty damn well. So, you might steal this.
Да. This elevator will take me deeper into the cave. It leads to unfathomable depths. I've heard about these ancient places. Are you ready to overcome your fear? What else can I do? Created them did not have good intentions. Their shapes seem ancient, but do not match any known civilization. They should remain undiscovered. Out. 
damn it. That's... <laughs> That's a jarring sound. Lately, our town has been filled with self-proclaimed explorers, sharing tales of strange places they claim to have found in the endless deserts. They describe vast stone holes or columns and altars appear crafted by something beyond human comprehension. The most unsettling are the sculptures of twisted, deformed figures unknown to any mythology. These places resemble temples dedicated to entities from beyond our world. The greed of those who ventured there became the curse. Deep within the ruins, they found a treasure. But those who tried to claim it never returned. The tracks disappeared and the treasures remain untouched as if frozen in time. Avoid these explorers and their stories, even if they sound like madness, there's a chilling truth in their words. As if these places hold secrets that should never be uncovered. Yeah, you know, why do we continually do the opposite of what uh, this person says? <laughs> Just don't have an explanation for that, I don't think. Hmm. This place is dedicated to something that the human mind cannot comprehend. Whatever built this place, worshiping forces that exist beyond time and space, where prayers are merely a cry into the void. What deities could have been worshipped here? Even their names are too bizarre to understand. of what may await me. Thank you. 
think I should probably uh, cut out some of this since it's not going to change too much. And there is still a lot of levers left to go. So I'll see you when I've maybe hit like lost five or so. Right, well that's the last five. I'm still missing the uh, yellow key. Now, speaking of which, uh, let me just check this little levers up here. This loops this little lip here. Where is this? That's where I've been. The looks of it. Okay. I guess probably I can find my way back out. Another lever. There's no coincidence that so many levers are waiting to be activated. I'm terrified of what this mechanism hides, but I know I must keep going. God, I hate you. Each of them is a step closer to discovering something that was deliberately sealed away. Okay, I've already been out here. Back we go. Uh, where are the yellow doors? I think there's... Are they both up top? Yeah, great. Walk up this. Of course not. It won't be too convenient. I think you can't get up that either. Mm -hmm. <laughs> not directly. with every step. What is about to happen when all of them are activated? A hole in the Last floor one. opens. There's no turning back now. That's I the idea. I feel as if at this very moment something has come to life as if this machine has been waiting for this day for ages. That's a lot of money. <laughs>
And the other room sure does look a lot more red than gold right now. Everyone. Yeah. Great. Oh, dude, here we go. wondering if I should call it here. Yeah, I think I might get tired. <laughs> Maybe it's just an excuse. Alright, well, regardless, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, next episode should hopefully be the end of it, but uh, I guess we'll see. Alright, bye.